Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a little fall desk slash iPad refresh. My favorite season is fall and I have a birthday that is about a week away from when fall typically starts. So I normally don't really get into the fall spirit or mood until after my birthday. And I will be honest in saying that I am hosting my friend's bachelorette slash bridal brunch at the end of the month. So I've decided against decorating downstairs, which is where I mainly decorate for fall. And I'm going to postpone that until October, of course, when we are finished with the bachelorette shenanigans because the colors of the that she's chosen for her brunch are actually going to clash with the fall colors, I do believe. So we're just gonna postpone that. But anyway, I did pick up about $25 worth of items from Target just the other day, and I actually decorated with every single one of those items in today's video. So we have, I have this desk, which is in our bedroom. It's not really ideal, but I did used to have a lot of desks or I still have a lot of desks because I used to have an, an Etsy shop. And so I just wanted to move some of the desks around. So one just landed in our room and I sometimes work from it to plan on my iPad or work on my computer or do other various things. So I do have two desks technically <laughs> that I use regularly and this is one of them and so I just threw about all of the fall decor I have not gone into my storage I only have one tote of fall decor make no mistake but I have not pulled that out as of yet because I'm kind of waiting for that so anyway first things first I have this new case that I got from Amazon I will have it linked down below and I it was kind of like the jumping off point for this fall iPad refresh because I am absolutely obsessed. Again, all of the decor pieces, every single last one of them came from Target, but that case, this case that we're looking at actually came from Amazon and so did these Apple pencil covers. These both came from Amazon and I got the beige and the brown pack or whatever because I'm gonna use the beige for all other seasons basically, you know, <laughs> outside of fall and I'm going to use the brown one for fall. Now, I'll be honest, brown typically isn't my favorite color. It's just, it just never has been, but I've been getting into beige in recent years, and so that's kind of lended itself to getting into brown a wee bit. I will say I love the color of the iPad cover way more, that brown, way more, whatever color that is, way more than I do this darker back brown that I'm using for the sleeve. I also got some new pencil tips from Amazon and all of these items I actually got with a gift card so that was pretty fun with a birthday gift card but I needed some new tips because I've been using the black tip that you see on my current pencil for I don't know probably years maybe like a year maybe that's dramatic so maybe like a year and it's time for that one to go so I bought this pack and it's a four pack and it has like a pink, a blue, I think a green and then a clear. And we are going to use the clear obviously because it goes better with the, the whole aesthetic that we're going for for fall. And I did put on a new protector, a matte paper-like, paper-esque, paper fill type of protector. But I had put that on a couple of days ago before I even thought of filming this video. And I did go ahead and clean it up of course, but I definitely already had that cover already on it or that screen protector already on it I just wanted to share with you the brand that I have been using for maybe the last five months or so because that is a pack of three so anytime or whenever the cover the screen protector I keep calling a calling it a cover whenever it gets crusty I just basically get rid of it and apply a new one so that is what took place now I'm originally having a little trouble with this sleeve but i will have you know that if you don't worry about trying to force the pencil into the sleeve but rather just kind of working the sleeve onto the pencil that proves to be a much better strategy so use that in the future as you go forth and add different sleeves and such to your apple pencils and i am using a apple ipad mini 6 so maybe it's the sixth generation i don't know this is my first ipad mini that i've ever purchased and i'm using a second generation apple pencil i do know that to be factual because there are only two and the first one looks vastly different from the second one now this sleeve i thought i read that it's supposed to allow me to charge my pencil while the pencil was in the sleeve, but that did not prove to be true. And I do have this holding spot over to the left. So basically you charge your pencil on the right side of the Apple 
iPad and then you can put, you can store your pencil in that little area right there to the left. And so I do have to say that I don't know that I'm going to be using that feature all too well or too much. I don't know. We're going to have to work out this sleeve situation because it's definitely supposed to charge, but I didn't feel like spending time trying to figure it out today. So we're just going to move forward with it, but it is I thought I read that it was supposed to charge. If not, I can't say that I really recommend this type of sleeve because this is not a sleeve that you can easily get your pencil out of. As you saw, it took a little work. So I don't recommend those types of sleeves or covers because it's just not that convenient. So if that's not the case, then I cannot recommend this sleeve, but maybe I'll get it to work. Maybe this one is faulty and I need to send it back, but we will cross that bridge when we get there. So I did have like this purple theme for the first half of September because the, my birthday what took place within the first half and my favorite color is purple, but I'm going to switch to this brown type of color and I get right now, I'm getting all of my wallpapers and such from Made to Plan. And is that where I'm getting it from? Oops, I think I just lied. I'm actually, is it the same company? It actually says Million Dollar Habit on it, whatever that means. But I thought, okay, I think I just made that up. Yeah, I'm getting it from Million Dollar Habit. And I think the owner is named Nita, perhaps, because that's who I get email for, emails from. So anyway, just FYI. But otherwise, you can definitely just create your own in Canva or you can go and just search for whatever theme that you're looking for, kind of like what I just did to find the other background, this one that I'm using. So you very well can use that method if you wish, but creating your own wallpaper will take no time in Canva. I just wait to see what freebies people release. And then if I like them, then I go with them. If not, I make my own. So right now I'm going ahead and I'm changing up my iPhone screen as well in the aesthetic to make it match because why not? And I am loving this brown type of color as we move into fall and I have gone ahead and updated my uh, other devices as well so it can all they can all match and be cohesive. But honestly you guys that is pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to refresh my desk and refresh my iPad and refresh my iPhone. So this is how it's looking. Again, I don't have all of my decor out, so I cannot, you know, really get in there and do all the decorating that I would wish that I wish to do. And I don't even know, I don't, I can't remember every single piece of fall decor that I have, but I'm interested in seeing what all I do have so I can potentially decorate this area a little differently. But as of right now, I'm not going into storage. And we're not doing all of that just yet because that would be something else that I would have to do. And I don't feel like doing anything else besides waiting until this bachelorette brunch or bridal brunch and like planning for it. That's all that I'm trying to do. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, subscribe if you're new and if you're liking what you're seeing. And I will catch you guys right back here in a few days in a brand new video. Bye guys.